Okay, so bees have decided to nest inside this asbestos pipe. What's a pipe? Type of tank. Looks like it was uh, used as a tank at some stage. I see that coming in and out there. So we want to try and lift this lid off, turn it upside down, and if the combs are not too big yet, um, but yeah, let's have a look. We want to transfer the combs that are in there. I suppose they're hanging off the inside of that lid. Uh, into this hive so we want to strap the individual combs they're not too long we'll have to trim them to fit into this um, into these frames transfer them as they are in sequence hanging from that lid no idea what it looks like in there uh, transfer them onto the frames into this hive Okay, so the colony is not bigger than I thought it would be. I was not able to flip this thing over. The combs will collapse and probably kill a lot of the colony. So we'll have to just remove the individual combs, transfer them into this hive box. Once we've transferred them, we'll take the lid off, put the hive on this position, say on two sticks to suspend it in this position, um, and then leave it there for a couple of days. So not, not moving them now, so that at least they have time to settle and all sort of regroup on this position. Eucalyptus honey, it's quite nice. You too. Okay. Now there you can see her actually the one with the long abdomen. You can see the workers smell her already. Right. So there she is. And put her in the middle. I 
a lot less disruption to the, to the bees and forcefully trying to move them on your lid. It seems like the bees can smell their queen now. Um, still a lot of bees outside, but they are moving up and into the hive. If you like this video, if you found it helpful at all, please, um, if you have any questions, leave it in the comments below. And uh, like and subscribe, we'd really appreciate that. See you on the next video. Cheers.